Okay, so it is January. I had planned to launch my Heather Unfiltered by now, and I'm a little off, and I think that I kind of waited because I wanted it to be perfect, and what do we know about that? Nothing's perfect. It's not going to be perfect. So I kind of wanted to do a rundown today. I haven't launched yet, but I kind of want to give everybody an idea of the message, where I'm headed, where I'm going, and a little bit about Heather Unfiltered because Heather Unfiltered is about me, but it's also about you. It's about life, living life, failures, accomplishments, success, the lack of success, stagnation, so many things, forgiveness, how to be alone with yourself, how to make healthy choices, when to cut ties, who are your friends, who aren't your friends, it's about rawness, about living, it's about life. And I wanna be able to touch on everything. I wanna to touch on the things that I have experience with, the things that you have experience with. Who are you unfiltered? Who could you be if you were given the opportunity to say what you wanted to say? Be who you wanted to be. Live free with your life, your dreams. Who would you be if you could be different? What would it take to be different? Is it about money? Is it about fear? Is it about lack of understanding as to what it is that you want to be? Are you happy with who you are? And what does it mean to be happy? Happiness is really, it's so many things. It's more than right now. It's what is it going to be and what is it going to look like tomorrow? Um, I think for me, the biggest struggles and the things that I have to live up to or the things that I struggle with the most are living up to my responsibilities of my own life, my own choices, good and bad. I have, I'm prone. If anybody knows me, they know I'm prone to mistakes. I'm prone to problems, issues wrong choices, wrong paths, um, the loudest one in the crowd, the vibrant one in the crowd, the girl that stands out. Sometimes that's good, sometimes that's bad. Um, I think attention has been an issue for me. Maybe good and bad attention. Understanding my role within it, how to handle it, how to know when to say no, and maybe not being so good at that, and maybe not saying yes when I should have. So as I launch a brand new website, um, and of course you guys have seen most of my positive, raw, very heartfelt posts that are going out on Instagram. Um, I'm Heather M. Miles. I am Heather Adams Miles right now on Facebook, but when I launch my website, Heather Unfiltered will have its own Facebook as well, so that will be part of it. Uh, Twitter will always probably remain Heather M. Miles as well, so you can get my feeds on that. Most of you know that I have many roles. I have been wife. That is something that is sadly potentially coming to an end. I am a mother, which is something that will never end. I'm an author and a writer, and I'm proud of that. It's something I want to continue to do. Heather Unfiltered for me is launching a website to tell the story of every person, the good and the bad. I have shared so much and so little. There's so many people that know the onion of my life. And sometimes I've been afraid to talk about some of these things. Some of them are so good. I've had so many happy moments. I've had some sad and tragic moments. I've had some family issues. I've had loss. I'm losing right now. And I want to talk about it. 
I want Heather Unfiltered to be a place and a landing ground for anybody that has to, or that just wants the ability to talk about it, even if it's forbidden, even if it's their forbidden fruit. So if it's sex, if it's sexting, if it's texting, if it's school, if it's boyfriends, girlfriends, husbands, affairs, if it's failures, if it's lack of self-worth, lack of integrity, a broken moral compass, whatever it is, it's Heather Unfiltered. This is your stopping ground. This is your landing pad for your life, for my life. I'm about to launch this. It's going to be big. I hope that you guys will join. I hope that you'll follow. I hope that you'll participate. And it should be one hell of a journey. Stay tuned.